What's popping? Can't hear me? Nah, 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 nah. Is this this ain't the far guy himself, is it? Yeah, the one and only. I heard a myth about a rumor. You know oh what I'm man, nah, nah, man. Let me. I need to finish my round. I said I'm hopping out new AR with the double drum. They said you survived hollow. Let's see you survive some other ones. <laughs> Stop playing with me! Stop playing with me! Yo, I, I <laughs> but look boom, at boom. you! But look at okay. you! All them okay. bars I took is truth. It don't matter how many hollows you got when a nigga bulletproof. I, I'm cooking you. I'm cooking you. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Round two on bottom. Let, rebuttal. <laughs> What's popping, my man? I'm good. What's popping, man? You got the, you got the internet on fire right now. You know, oh, I used yeah. to get back to the old school, and I, I used to go back to the old school. Had a battle that uh, wasn't on camera, wasn't on pay-per-view, which was really a mitigated risk because you you battle in perception and you're battling a big name. And I want to set the stage for you, then I'm going to be quiet and let you just give the whole synopsis of your battle, the event, how you felt. But I'm saying you took a risk, and, the, and that being a risk is you're battling against a super name, a legend, one of the you know bigger names in this sport who has a huge fan base, which everybody could easily be like, Danny lost, Danny lost, Danny lost, Danny lost before the footage even comes out. So you right, take that right. risk wholeheartedly knowing going into it, no matter what you did this year, a lot of people would look at you as the underdog. And then you took a couple battles before that battle, which really turned the tide and had people like, Danny doesn't know what the hell he's doing. And you go into this battle with a lot of people saying, you're going to lose because they're like, they just seen what, had happened last. And I know I had made a blog about you, but it was kind of reverse psychology. I did it to put the perspective out there that I know you're better than what just happened. But even as a friend of mine, I have to do this because you're going to see it. You're going to comment on it. And when you go into the the next universe to set up for your battle, you're going to be using all of that as motivation. So now here's where I stop. I just want you to give the world your Thoughts of what, what happened, how it went, and we need to know uh, the juice world bar. You got oh, it. Oh well, uh, uh, well. First of all, uh, thank you, man. Shout out to you. Um, shout out to Hollow, uh, the the whole charity event. Uh, Geechee, Big T, everybody that was on the card. Ron Compton, Bobby Lee, uh, Billy Boondock, Side Dog. So yeah, and the day one guys too. Shout out to them and KG. Smack Beasley, uh, they was out there. Everybody was there. Like the West was, they was there. Um, I cannot t- too much give away too much of the battle itself. You know what I'm saying? Because that's the whole purpose mm-hmm. of us doing like the watch lives. But I will yeah, say that right. the the people the people will be seeing the battle. Like the like y'all y'all gonna see the battle. Like I I know people was like oh we're we're never gonna see it. You're gonna see it. it you just mm-hmm. just be patient. It's, y'all gonna see it. Like mm-hmm. you know the battle. Like I mean Smack called it a classic. After Smack Beasley, they they was they, they they felt like that was a classic. The fans, man, you got you got Hollow, you got the vintage Hollow, like you got Hollow, like y'all. If y'all didn't like them in the Mass Battle, y'all didn't like them in the John John Battle, you definitely gonna love this Hollow. You know what I'm saying? Mm. I, I will say that. Uh, my, myself, I I felt like yeah, okay, Danny under I'm under, I'm I'm under pressure. You know, okay, I just. You know, y'all seen me choke all three rounds versus Stewie. Then y'all mm-hmm. seen me fuck up versus Pass. You Talk know what I'm saying? It. Like guys who I I you feel like be, I I would have I would have beat them. I'll say that. I mean, I feel like I definitely would beat them had I got my bars out. It's just mm-hmm. like I always say, the separation is in the preparation. If you're not prep, you going that's what's gonna happen to you when you're trying to prep last minute for a nigga. So. You know it was what it was. I'm not. Would you run it back with them? No, no, no. They they won fair and square, man. They they got me okay. fair and square. I, I I will never, you know, let them have that they they moment, bro. Like, and they needed that anyway. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like these were the these are probably the only two guys in the world that can say they clearly beat me. I think <laughs> these are like the only two guys in the world that can say I clearly beat Danny. Because any yeah. other ones that you may want to debate, oh Danny, well so and so beat you, and this it ain't clear. It's debatable. Mm. So, but I, I say these like passing Stewie got uh, the clear wins. But anyway, aside from that, 
they got their shit. They they won fair and square. I wasn't ready. They was, and that's what happened in battle rap. You know, it ain't no mm-hmm. excuse. And one um, thing I will say, I, though, don't lose your thought. Don't lose your thought. But one thing I will say is that you take your wins like you take your losses, you know, and we've had many conversations, a lot that will probably, well, that will never make it out to the public, but when you lost right. battles like those two, you never felt a way about it. And I tweeted yesterday, mm-hmm. I said that, you know, when you had the battle and you got lost the pass or lost the studio, you know, I, I made a blog about you. And then one funny thing is I have other friends that I'm really close to in battle rap, and they told me, like, wow, that's crazy that you had to do that with Danny, but, I mean, he, they knew why. They were like, I get why you're doing that, because if it came to me, I know you would do the same. But it's like, damn, you know, 20,000 people saw it. I would have felt crazy about it. I wouldn't have went wild and out in public, but I would have said that was my man. But I said, Danny understood why. It's because we're looking at you as we need you to be one of the leaders of this force. And you Absol- can't show absolutely. Up and just have these bad, bad yeah. games like this. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely, man. I I will say, man, uh, yeah, I never get salty about nothing. You know, I'm not. I'll never be emotional about nothing. I've never mm-hmm. blocked nobody on Twitter. I've never blocked you nobody on Facebook. It yeah, it's it's whatever. Like it's it's it come with the game. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Like you take the bad with the good and accept responsibility when you lose or when a nigga smoke you. You gotta eat that man. You gotta eat that and congratulate that man. Don't hate that man. Don't be mad at that man. Congratulate him because he did his fucking job. And, in fact, him beating your ass should be inspirational to you to make you feel like, I, I don't never want to go through this again. I don't never want to feel this again. And he just inspired me to kick the, my next dude ass. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So come down to me and hollow. I, I, I called him out uh, 2015 John I battle, third round. Mm-hmm. I said, tell, tell hollow to Don he got to see me for that gold title. And I knew yep. he was going to hear it because he was there battling past Faye. And we was taking shots back and forth. He dropped bars on me. I dropped bars on him. We was doing it back and forth for a couple of years. And uh, I people was telling me, yo, Hollow's the GOAT, Danny. No, Charlie Clips the GOAT. Niggas was like, nah, Danny, you the GOAT, bro. Like, real shit, you the most consistent ever. Uh, I don't know. It's out of you, Clips, Hollow, it's other niggas, Arsenal. So, my, my, but here's the thing. I'm I'm not the most popular guy. I'm not the, the, the flashiest whatever guy. I'm just the guy that wanted to be the best, period. I didn't want to be the mm-hmm. best West Coast rapper. I didn't want to be the best punchline rapper. I want to be the best battle rapper that ever did it. If I'm not gonna if I'm not gonna be the best that ever did it, then why am I doing it? That's how I feel. Mm, you got rebuttals on the spot. You just rebuttaled me on the spot like come on man. Like you always you oh you really always ready, man. Like you you wanna Yo. you leave the house with bars. <laughs> like you, you I watched you versus Big T today came out. Um, oh, I'm yeah. gonna recap that later. Yeah, it was good like work. Yeah, it was him, cool work. Clear. You got him clear. Uh, I felt like it was. I had it kind of like uh, one one ish going into the third, but then his third was short, and you wilded your third. That was your craziest round. But uh, we'll yeah, recap yeah. that later. We'll recap that later. But I want to talk about. Uh, let's do this. Um, give me Big T versus Geechee first. Who you felt like got that one? Let's do. Something. Oh God, man! Listen, man. Geechee is is this nigga's an anomaly, man. I'm mm. not biased. I, if, if my man lost, I would say my man lost. He you would because you told me you've told me battles yeah, more recently. Yeah, I told you. Yeah, lost. I told. Yeah, and I ain't gonna say so, which ones, but and even with your people, you told me when your people lost. So I mean, I will say yeah, that. Yeah, nah, nah. Geechee got him. Geechee got him mm-hmm. out of there, man. Like it was that. I'm not. There's no question about that. That's he. He we won, but I will say it was a loss to where you're not mad at Big T. Big T mm. did big Big T gave you what you wanted to see from him. Big T gave you kinda the, like, the yeah. big T. Kinda he like gave you big T. Yeah, kinda like yeah. the battle's chess. You don't care who lost because they had such a good battle that it really doesn't matter who won or lost. They both Yeah, no, that battle was great, man. That battle was great, man. But uh uh Gotti, I, I thought he had he got a thirty on that one, man. Gotti oh, with the thirty geez. on Big T, man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like y'all, y'all to see it. You know what I'm saying? Y'all to see it. It was, it was, it was a thirty, but it was, it was a gentleman's thirty. It wasn't like he, oh, he yeah, killed yeah. them by. Yeah, he didn't body him, and dog him, but it was like clear that Geechee just had too many bars every round and it crazy like rebuttals. A, rebuttals. It, wasn't, it, wasn't, shaking. it was more like a, it was more like a Lakers and Clippers game, not a Knicks game. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. Like, they get blown all the way out. You know what I mean? Big T was, shows uh, some phenomenal veteran level writing skills. I will say that Big T had a great performance. 
great writing. It's just sometimes your your, your opponent just going to have a, a better night than you, and that's all it was. Yo, he says different it things. Was. Like, he, he'll say some things. Like, I watched him versus you today, and he took something so simple as, you the type of nigga that'll write about anything to make it rap with anything, and it doesn't mean any like that type of shit is so <laughs> crazy that he could come up with that. Like, <laughs> it is like so simple, but then it's complex because it has three different meanings at the same right. time. So you're perplexed by the fact that he can literally take such minuscule phrases and make complex. It is crazy, but I liked it. Uh, so even though that's good to see Big T, even if um he did get the win that he did his thing. Now, all right, man, you know what we're here for. You know what we want. You know what the people want, man. They want to know you versus Hollow the Don, man. We don't need many bars, man. We don't need none of that. We need you to walk us through it, the parallel and the regular universe, and just let us know what happened. Uh, and the reason why I say this, I had to get you on the phone, was because I understand that the size of my platform and the people that listen to it and the people that will subscribe and check out what's going on, they don't want to hear me say, I heard this person did that or I heard. That's not fair to you or to Hollow. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not fair for me to say, I heard this person hey. got smoked. You know what I'm saying? It's not fair. Hey, hey, man, listen, I'm going to say it like this. Uh, there are people, so I don't want it to be like, oh, Danny's just saying he beat, he won, he won. No, listen, it, 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 there are people that were in the building that actually felt like, oh, Hollow got it. Hollow 2-1. Okay. People, people feel like Hollow 2-1. You know, there are people, you know, and I'm I'm pretty sure you be as hollow, he'll tell you he he felt like he got it. So, you know, that like if you get hollow on the phone, he's gonna tell you he won. I'm telling you that I felt I definitely won. That's how I feel. I didn't feel like mm. I lost. Like, period. Around. And you've had that like you felt like you lost. <laughs> oh, oh Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, man. This this is not one of those, man. Uh I, I I will say I, a lot of people gave me the win in the building. A lot of people that were in the building, you know, I, I had niggas crying, bro. I had niggas niggas walking off third, stage. You, you were saying you were saying the third round was um was going to be epic. I didn't hear it, and I, the funny thing is, a lot of people don't know. I hear a lot of your material before it goes out, but this material was something. The only thing I heard was the first. You know what I'm saying? I think you was wild in the first, but you say your third was going to be uh was going to be special. You did say that. Yeah, well, I, I, yeah, it was, it was, it was probably the most powerful round this year in battle rap. Easily, gotta be the most powerful really? round this whole year. Yes, easily. Wow. Niggas, wow. niggas was crying, bro. Niggas was crying. Niggas walked off stage. Niggas was walking out the building. Uh, I was crying. Whoa. I was crying yeah, while wanna, rapping. Um, it. I wanna, I wanna, I, um, I, I was wanna crying. Check, I wanna check that, but once we get off, when I get off the line, with you, you know what I'm saying? When I get, when we get off the public line. We'll, we'll rap about <laughs> with some of that. Yeah, that, uh, yeah, no, I, I cried while rapping it, man. And it's wow. crazy because I, I said I, it was crazy because I rapped around like a hundred times, going like just in rehearse practicing and got through the shit. But then when I got on the stage and I felt the emotion from the crowd, that shit made me tear up. Wow. Yeah, man. Sometimes you, you fuck. Sometimes shit just be deeper than like a punchline or. Or or a metaphor. Like sometimes niggas need that that real rap. Sometimes niggas need real pain, man, and still make it relatable to your opponent. And I I just so want to on, get a fans some shit they can feel. So word on the street is uh you rapped about Juice World in your battle. He passed away. What made you think of something like that that quick? Oh uh, man, uh <laughs> it really I I, I it related to Hollow. I felt like I was, I said uh you fucking drug addict don't act like we'll all feel tomorrow. Don't die like Juice World did today. That's a hard pill to swallow. I <laughs> man, niggas was in there like, yo, and he came back with his own Juice World bar. He came back with his like right after, like in the third round, he had one. But uh, it was like, I like when I got that news that morning, it just like, damn, man, niggas gotta stop. Whatever these niggas out here doing, I don't know what's going on. I'm not even sure why, what he passed away from, but it's just a reminder, like this, this uh, drugs and stuff like that ain't. It's not cool, man. And like I said, when I was talking about my wife going through drug addiction and us losing our kids and things of that nature in my third round, sometimes you just gotta get niggas real rap, man. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's like you, because at the end of the day, this shit is supposed to have a message to it. 
Every right. like pu- punches is cool. Like you could punch line like this, like that, like this. Put a forty on his chest like Sean Kemp. Like, whatever, whatever. <laughs> you, yeah. Those are cool. But like sometimes you gotta give niggas something that's gonna stick with them. Like you might say yeah. something that might change somebody else. Like like people don't understand the power of words. Words are, are very powerful. So if you have a platform to, to be able to make change or touch somebody's heart, then why yeah. not do it? You know Nothing. what I mean? And just with me going through all... See, niggas act like I had a, a terrible year. I No, nigga, I, I gave niggas Mac Myron, Bankhead, Franchise, Disaster. Chef Trez, Disaster. Disaster, Old Red, Big T Chess. I helped put on newer cats that ain't never heard, had no name. Nobody even knew them. I took on the niggas that motherfuckers was and ducking, like but, Stack but, but, Almighty. You said all that. You said all that. You didn't say hollow. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on now. Yeah, like, hollow is done. Hollow and disaster in one year. This is what I'm saying. So when I choke versus uh, uh, Stewie and Paz, it's like they just want to race all that. Like, come on, man. I'm out here giving y'all great battles week after week. Me and Amzilla just dropped this morning. Like, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Me and Big T just dropped this morning. I'm whoop, mm. I'm dog. I'm putting in work. So when I, it's okay. So if a nigga mess up two games out of 25, it's like, ah, oh, y'all, 25 y'all. And two? Is he still not 25 and two? <laughs> yeah, I'm 23. Yeah, I'm 20. Yeah, I'm, 20 yeah. I'm 23 and two, my nigga. Like, damn. Damn. So Tyler LeBron might only get 10. You know what I'm saying? He might only score. I done seen Jordan only 12 points. You know what I'm saying? Like, right, damn. Right, right. First, feel me, and you going against – you are going against the top niggas in the world, too. Like, he, like Pat, first of all, pass ain't no hope. Pass is a goddamn had, legend. You Pat stay at the end of last year, too. You've been wild. Yeah, exactly. Man. Yeah, DNA, Pat stay. You know what I'm saying? I'm taking on these, these, these killers, bro. These is vets, legends. You know what I'm saying? So when, when niggas want to highlight – oh, you know what it was, though? It's because niggas never – they never see me choke, you know what I'm saying? They they never really see Danny choke. Like I'm constant, so it kind of was mm-hmm. like, damn. Let me let me let me give y'all some perspective on what's really going on. Since y'all want to mm-hmm. come down on me and act like, oh, then you just fucked up your champion of the year shot. All right, well, since y'all want to talk, let's talk. We're gonna have a conversation now, and that's mm-hmm. why I did that. My third round, Hollow got busy. Hollow got busy. Like I said, this was I brought out I brought out one of the better hollows of his career. So mm. yes, I, I brought out Hollow, the bet the one y'all wanted to see. He he did great and, and there's, there's gonna be a lot of Hollow fans or Daddy fans who felt like Hollow won the battle. So we're not mm. I'm not taking away the victory from Hollow. I'm not saying he uh, definitively lost. To me, he did. Oh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You, you ask me. I, I, I don't think he. I don't think he. I, I don't feel like. He, I don't feel like he beat me around. Like honestly, like that's just coming. I'm. I, y'all know I'm the most honest, non-biased. Even on myself, I keep the same energy on myself when I fuck up. When I do good, I, I, I just tell how I feel, bro. Like I, yeah, feel I got it. No, let's um, let's let's put this let's put this out there for the uh, perspective. They, a lot of people don't know that when it came to you battling against Stewie Newton. Like, I called you with um, something that I didn't mean, you know, to be real real harming. All you versus pass, you know what I'm saying? I made an innocuous statement saying that, you know, it wasn't meant to hurt you, but saying, like, yo, you asked for these battles to come out because you don't want to block their shine. Battles that Facts. you clearly love. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, let's talk about that, voices. too. Yeah, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I, hey, I'm glad you brought that up because, honestly, man, they didn't even want to put out me and Stewie because it's just kind of like, Damn, Danny choked all three rounds. And it's not because they was trying to protect me. It was more so like they got to put it on the app, and they know in the comments everybody seems like, damn, nigga, we paying $8 a month, and y'all going to give us a battle where a nigga just choked all three rounds? Man, I ain't watching this shit. Fuck you, smack. Nigga, give me this battle. Give me this one. I, where is this one? So they ain't even want that backlash because they like, why? It's not even worth putting out. I said, no, drop the battle. That only reason URL dropped that battle is because I requested, I demanded that please drop this. Let my man Stewie get his shine, bro. Don't hide my bodies, cause whatever happened in the battle, it need to be seen. Cause, cause when I when I beat O Red, when I beat O Red and he was choking, you needed it to be seen. You needed it to be seen. Yeah, regardless, if he, you know, what I'm saying that would not be fair to me. So I got to keep the same energy on myself. See what I'm saying? Oh, Red, I was like, 
Oh, Red was trying to get it voted. He was trying to get that shit voted. That's why when I, I don't know what I did, I got up on him, he kind of pushed me. I felt like he was trying to incite me to fight, and now it's really voted. So I'm like, nah, I'm not going to fall for it. Yeah, I'm not going to fall for it. Nah, I need this to come out, nigga, because I told you for five years I would body you, and and, and I did it. (laughs) So, you know what I'm saying? And so I need it. I need it. would have been fucked up, and I I probably would not even fuck with URL no more if they didn't put it out. See what oh, I'm yeah, saying? Like, nah, yeah, don't don't play me like that, nigga. Like, nah, nigga, put my shit out. So when Stewie did that, when I choked versus Stewie and he got his sign on, man, man, let my nigga get his sign, man. I don't give a fuck about these comments and what nigga saying. You no, know what I mean? Like, in the real world, I'm a, in the real I'm a real world, man. Yeah. And in the real world, you know the energy that you get and the vibe that you receive. Like, people talk all the time about whether it be myself, you, anybody. And I'm like, when we're in the real world and out seeing people in real public, they show so much love. And, it, you know, so the Internet really doesn't matter. But one a question that I did have is, uh, does it loyal, does LOM still stand for lack of maturity, or did that change yesterday? <laughs> man, you can't give, nah, you can't give man. It away, but, uh, <laughs> man. <laughs> yo, yo. Yo, I, I I couldn't change the copyright or nothing like that, but nah, nah. Hollow did his shit, man. I will say he did his shit, and I'm I'm quite sure like his fans will definitely be satisfied with what he brought because he was entertaining. He had gimmicks, he had tricks, and here and let me tell you something. Let me matter of fact, let me tell you something just exclusively for your channel right now. So I it what was that yesterday, right? Okay, so I had got word through the grapevine from a reliable source that Hollow was going to do something in his third round. Mm-hmm. So I was like, I was like, oh, okay, that's what he's going to do? All right, so cool. All right, I can't stop him from doing it, but I can't sabotage it because I got, I got the information. Hollow didn't know that I knew he was going to do it. So what I did was, all right, when he do that, I'm going to rebuttal that shit crazy. So I had just got some rebuttals together real fast. And, you know, my wife was like, nah, when he do that, then you need to do it back. So let's go to the store and get these. And I'm like, nah, because now it's going to look like a gimmick battle. But long like story short, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, long story short, I knew he was going to do what he did in his third round with the uh, with the, 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 the laser pointer and the, the laser pointers. And, the, you know, I knew that was coming. So so it happened. So, <clears throat> yeah, he did it. So what, what? But the thing was, I was like, okay, if I go last, because I knew it was coming in the third round. I was like, okay, so if I go last, I'm just going to rebuttal that shit and shake the fucking building. So since I already know he's going to do it, let me put these rebuttals together right quick. So I had them. But the thing is, he won a coin toss and made me go first. So now I know he's about to get that off on me last, and I can't do nothing about it. But I can do something about it. But, but I can do something about it because I can say, and I know you about to do this. And I could have fucked it up for him. But, it, but mm. I'm, a, I'm such a real nigga. I'm like, nah, I ain't going to say it. I'm going to let, 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 yeah, yeah, let my man get his shit off because I want it to be as good as the battles it can be. Why well, fuck up my man mm. around? Like, that's, plus, that's like some buster shit anyway. Like, you got, that's like if you know a nigga around or some shit. And like and call somebody him and tell him, yeah, 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 you can't do that. That's a spot. Yeah, That's I wasn't gonna do that. I, I could have did it. I could have mm-hmm. did it because I knew I, I I wasn't gonna have the chance to rebuttal it, so I could pre buttle it. You know what I'm saying? I, as a matter yeah, of fact, yeah. I think it happened with Twerk and John John, and I think somebody told oh, with the with the with the, with the strip club scheme. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I, yeah. yeah they they told Twerk. He found out about it, and Twerk actually, he said, and I know you about to, you know what I'm saying? He Twerk did that. Do a whole you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. He twerks, Twerk told him that he knew he was about to do it, and John John was like, fuck it, I'm going to do it anyway, and he did it anyway. But see, I could have did the same thing Twerk did. I could have said, and I know yeah, you. You could have easily, easily, easily been like, you could have I know what the scheme's going to be. I got niggas in the crowd to put niggas that's going to put beams on the niggas that put beams on me. And they could have started pointing to you before you, you know what I'm saying? Ooh, like, I could have fucked this yeah. whole shit up, bro. But I'm like, nah, man, let, let my man rock. Name. Let my man rock, bro. Let him get let him get him. But honestly, yeah, I felt like even when he did it, it, it wasn't like like that was, was a game changer. Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't a game changer anyway, because my third was so it was my third was so powerful. It was like it didn't matter anyway what he did after that. Like my third was like nothing you could do. So 
he 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 and shout out to Hollow because when I spit my third, it it felt like he had another third, but he said nah, I finna nah, I can't let him get to get this off. Let me freestyle and rebuttal this whole my his whole third. So he brought his own version of the struggles he been going through, and it's like mm. he couldn't he could not have known what I was gonna do. So he kind of like freestyled some crazy shit, which was dope. And that was like master level type of shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, that, it was dope, man. Hollow so why he's one of the greats, man. He so why he is one of the greats, bro. But I, a lot of, when I left out of there, it was so many people telling me they feel like I got it, like, clear. Like, no, nah, I ain't going to say clear, but they feel like I got aged every round, every round. And you know, and you know what the thing is, I had, a, I had a couple people that I really, um, have admiration for and I really like, you know, I value their opinions. They were kind of hitting me up telling me who they felt like won the battle and things like that. And I had people asking me this morning, like, yo, why do you always got the recaps? And I said, and I quote, I said, I don't recap battles that I didn't see with my own eyes because you guys have such big brands that I can't throw a monkey wrench in what somebody got going on by jumping out the window and putting out some material saying somebody won a battle. But I said, if you get a battler on the phone to interview and they state their side of the story and how they felt, then that's a different story. But me saying it, I would never do something like that. Nah, nah. But uh, like I said, man, it's you. You know, if y'all felt hollow one, that's dope. That's and this shit is in pain. But at the end of the day, we both brought three crazy rounds. No chokes, mm-hmm. no stumbles. We we both was in there rebuttaling. We was in there having fun. We was in there dropping crazy bars and haymakers, crazy haymakers mm-hmm. on each other. We shaking the building on each other. It, it like when you got two niggas that's like goat level niggas, like you got the type of battle you were supposed to get. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Like you got the type of battle you were supposed to get. So hey, it's it's real dope. We was able to do that. But at the end and of the day, you, I, I feel like you, I, 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 said, I won. Fuck that, I, I won, you, I nigga. Said, hey. <laughs> <laughs> I said in the blog, I, I, I try to be humble. He tried. He tried hard. But I told you, I said, uh. You want the word to be coming out of there. As Danny did his thing, Danny won. It was a debatable. It was a classic. They both went back and forth. You don't want the word coming out of there to be you lost, you got smoked. You, got <laughs> you don't want that to be the word. Be hey, safe. check this you out. Everybody going to be ready for you. Check this out. First, this, further, this further goes to show how cold I am. I keep saying I'm too cold. For me to be cold. able to, for me, for me to be able to put that, 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 them three rounds together, in three days and take the other four days to memorize and still win or at least make it to where it's debatable after having had just battled Paz, Big T, Amzilla, Stewie, this guy, Laura Rose, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. For me to be able to put together three rounds and get out of there with niggas saying I 30 hollow, with on top of me having a million battles before him, and he didn't have nothing, it shows the level I'm at. That's why I said tell Lux to stop playing with me. Stop Mm -hmm. playing with me. Lux just told me, Lux just told me in New York, he said, nigga, Danny, you need to start writing for me right now, nigga. I said, all right, nigga. Watch what I do to your man. When I get your man out of there, come out and avenge him. So now, you know, 2020, Lux, stop fucking, stop playing with me. We can't just, no, you know, we can't just do that. You can't just say that like you talk about uh, rookie mode, this Hall of Fame mode right here. So you basically. I'm Hall of Fame mode. I'm Hall of Fame mode. Them niggas kept saying, them niggas kept saying, oh, Danny, how you feel? You got hollow. You got hollow. Nigga, hollow got me, nigga. I'm the one out here working. I'm putting in the work. I'm working. He chilling. He chilling. He just lost the math. Nah, listen, man. He just he lost the math and been chilling. Nigga, I've been working. So, yeah, when I take them two bullets, when you're in the field, you, you're more likely going to get shot a couple times when you're in the field every day. We did it. As no, opposed to a nigga did. that's... As opposed to a nigga that's going, he in there every six months, eight months, got whole six months to prep for a nigga. I'm prepping for <laughs> niggas on, on day's notice. And so when I, yeah, so I took a couple, I took a couple shots. Yeah, they got me, yeah. Still, we called Danny lacking. 
uh, pass caught Danny lagging. Danny trying prepping one day for these niggas. It didn't work. I, I'm not twerk shit. That's that twerk shit don't work for me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? At least get, get give me seven days at least. Like give me seven days, I'll be good. You know what I'm saying? So you're not gonna so, go back watch your old battles and then come up with. <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah, but I'm saying, nigga. The I kept saying, nigga, Hollow got Danny, nigga. Like, I don't – yeah, he's a bigger name in the coach. He got the more – the views, the followers, the fame, the LOM, the brand. He's the GOAT level. He's elite. Nigga, at the end of the day, this shit's still about rapping. Fuck all the attributes. Fuck what he did or who he battled. Nigga, what about the skill set? What about bar? What about the pin? What about the pin? None of that shit don't help niggas when they in there with me. None, none of them attributes. Rex had to find out. Motherfucker, I've been in there with Charlie Clip. Oh, Charlie Clip, don't kill you. Got in there. Got him out of there. You know what I'm saying? I'm in there with Pat Stay. I'm duking it out with niggas that are supposed to kill me. What about K-Shine? Mm. Got him out of there. 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 Stop it. Stop it, nigga. Nigga, got him out of there. Disaster. I beat, hey, I, I I would say disaster story was crazy. I love his story, but man, my first two rounds, I got him out of here. So I'm not going to tell you, I, I'm not going to tell you I lost to these niggas, bro. Like, no, because when you can't show me that I clearly lost, you can't tell me I lost. That's how I feel. So I, I, I kept saying, yo, yeah, hollow, yeah, he's hollow, yeah, but come on, man, let's, let's come on. He's in there with the bar guy, bro. I'm I'm really one of these niggas with that pen, bro. Like I know he is he does he's all around, he's unorthodox, he's great at everything. Nigga, me too. What the fuck me you talking too. about? <laughs> me too. Me too. He said, yeah, okay, now did, that's why he, now he, when he you put us Did he do your predictable did he say he was a predict your style? Did he try to do that? No, I don't think no I not that I recall. I don't think he tried to no, I don't think he tried to do that. But I, I but my fire. parallel, my, my parallel. Cancer. My uncle was a cancer. He had cancer in his toe. That was fire. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Man, yeah, he told off that. Like, his his no freestyle. On. That's the nigga. Yeah, the neck is true. That shit in the battle. He should have said it in the battle. <laughs> yeah, that yeah, that's crazy, right? You know what yeah. I'm saying? But I, I just felt like, all right, now you you want to put me in there with Hollow? Y'all say to go. I keep telling y'all, I'm the go. So now when I go in here and beat the nigga that y'all said was go, now what y'all got to say? Now what? Now what? Who's next? Like, who else is the go? Y'all told me Clips was the go. I got him out of here. Who who else is the go? Y'all saying Lux is the go? All right. Go get him. Bring, okay, go so get him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I would tell you a battle that I am interested in seeing you in. I mean, it's not the goat. I mean, you know what I mean? But it's another person who's had a good year, rising year, the saga. I do want to see you versus saga. I still will continue <laughs> to campaign for that. Hey, I, me and saga, we, we just spoke about that yesterday, man. Y'all going to be seeing that real soon. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, y'all, y'all finna see that. Y'all finna see that 2020, man. Saga been on, on fire. Him, got I got, yeah, oh, man, that's what I'm, I'm listening. Every time they tell me one of these niggas got a pen, what I do to him? Oh, Danny, quantum physics is the he. Oh, his pen, he's like he's like up there with looks. All right, what happened to no, him? Thirty. Thirty. Oh, Chilla, Chilla's gonna. Ki- what happened? Thirty. Yeah. Stop oh. playing with me. Stop oh, giving me these man. pins, these goats, all these niggas that y'all be saying is this and that. I get them out of there. Mm. Especially when I'm like, you know what I'm saying? When I'm prepped too. I, I don't lose, bro. Like, I don't lose battles. I lose keys. I lose women. I don't lose rap battles, bro. Wow. <laughs> you, you always said that, too. You say you lose money, you lose this, you lose that. You don't lose rap battles. I don't lose no rap, lose battles. rap battles. When I lost even, and not to, not to, listen, real shit, not to discredit Stewie or Pash, because they won fair and square, right? But mm-hmm. they more so won because I didn't rap my rounds. I get my rounds out, these niggas not surviving this. They not survive. I could post my bars online. I could post my rounds for, for Stewie and Pass. You know what I'm saying? But it's like, nah, it ain't no need to do that. Like, let them niggas have they shine. I'm just saying, I lost because I lost. I don't feel like they beat me. I beat myself in those two situations. So this is why I be saying, like, I don't fucking lose rap battles. This the difference. Mm. It's like I ain't never spit by three rounds, and a nigga spit his three rounds, and I, and I still got 30. I still lost. Wait, like, when did that happen? 
You know, that hasn't happened. Niggas going to tell, oh, no, Danny. No, Danny, you talking that shit. Things beat you. Things beat you. Now, when I, I say, okay, well, okay, from that day, where did I, where am I at? Where's things at? Talk to me. Somebody has a yeah, question. Yeah, don't yeah, take too long. Yeah, yeah. Don't take too long. <laughs> Nigga. I got nothing don't. for you. I got nothing for you. I, I, got, I, got, I got nothing. I got nothing. That's not the shot. That's nothing. not the shit on my man's themes. But I was in Brooklyn, in his house. They made it look a certain way. But when niggas went back and listened to them bars, it's like, oh, yeah. Yeah, Danny, yeah, Danny, yeah. Danny's that nigga, man. I posted my third LeBron. round for they things. Got LeBron. They got the LeBron meme. I don't know. How the hell am I supposed to answer that? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Check this that. out, man. Ill Will, you have been going crazy this whole year. You have been beating niggas. You have been beating niggas, man. You going in there, niggas saying you beat uh, Pass and... Ill Mac oh, and Geechee, and they saying this and that. You beat Trez. All right. All right, Ill Will. It's, it's, it's five years overdue, man. It's five years. They tried to set me and him up on Spit That Heat. They tried to set us up on this card, this card. It always fell through. It's time, Ill Will. Stop fucking playing with me. And I didn't forget when you jumped in Mac Meyer and Round you're, you're, and did that. Yeah, y'all got that haymaker off on me. Nigga, the vendetta is there. Ill Will, wow. Iron Solomon, Lowly Lux, T Top, and motherfucking Shug. That nigga really, I don't know, man. Shug got to go. He got to mm. go. Mm. I, and I respect oh. Shug because he's a real warrior. He don't. He mm-hmm. said he want all the pins. He been calling my. He tweet my name every fucking day. Oh, Danny Trash, I'ma kill this nigga. I'ma kill him. All right, nigga. You just, okay, you wanted the pins? What happened? You got in there with Nitty. What happened? Got, Nitty mm-hmm. got you out of there. You wanted, mm-hmm. oh, JC. J, oh, you wanted another pin? Get in there with mm-hmm. JC. What happened? Got you out of there. Nigga, you are not beating no pins. Mm-hmm. I, I, okay, you got Mike P. Let's not, let's not, let's not shit on, let's not shit on Shook. He did get Mike P. I think that was volume one. Yeah, that yeah, was volume one. He, he, he beat Mike P. I thought Mike P was going to win. Shook surprised me. He got that one. Right, right, right. But been honestly, a couple since then, though. Shug been losing battles, man. He been losing. He been losing. He lost past Pastay. Uh, uh, that was a good battle. He lost Trez. He lost Trez. Good battle. He lost to Trez. I, I, ain't, I ain't see him beating Trez. Who, where I see that at? Trez won. <laughs> it, it, honestly, it wasn't, it wasn't the greatest battle from either one of them. So if you so now you could just go into the debatable territory where uh, I don't know who won. It don't really matter. Okay, cool, but you still lost the trash anyway. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Nitty uh, smoked I think you. He, yeah, yeah, Nitty. Uh, he had Gluezy, but I mean, Gluezy don't really win that often. He had that one. That was about a year or so ago. Uh, Man, listen. Had... Shug, Shug. Okay, he he probably got Tay Rock in the, in, in the update card, and that's and and that's because Tay Rock messed his rounds up. You know what I'm saying? That's only reason. Like. He was getting smoked. Like, every round, Tay Rock was smoking Suge in there. Tay Rock just fucked himself up, so Suge won on, won on the technicality. I wouldn't be proud of a win like that if I was Suge. He trashed, man. The nigga, the nigga's skills is diminishing. Like, he's getting older. He's, his moves are running out. We, we waiting on the pocket tap. We waiting on the dunk. Like, ah, come on, Suge. Where the, where the bars? What's your life like? When I was right, when I was doing this, Shut the fuck up, bitch. Can you rap? No. Don't play that game with me. Get in there with me, and I'm going to smoke him, Solomon, and Ill Will, and Lux. Then I'm retiring. I'm just going just, just to be an analyst. I'm just going to be a fucking analyst. 40 years old next <laughs> month. Nigga, I'm 40 years old January 19th. Next month, I'm 40. I, 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 I shouldn't even be able to still be coming up with this many crazy bars at this age and still having this level of energy and, and like, this the creativity at this age, 28 years battle rapping. This is why wow. I be saying, man, I am the GOAT, man. Like, y'all could say this and that about who, whoever. Oh, yeah, Danny not swaggy, Danny not popular. Nigga, just skill set alone and the fact that I'm old, I'm an old nigga, still beating on these young boys out here. Stop playing with me. Mm, yo, y- so are you, y- are, you still a, are you still a fan? Like, will you watch, like, Newer guys, you know what I mean. I'm not gonna get into. I, 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 yes, I, 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 I watch. Those are the ones I watch the most. Cause these, all these other niggas ain't. They all saying the same shit. They, you know, a lot of them 
getting past their prime, man. Like I, them, I watch the newer guys the most. So you'll you watch like saying? the newer pins, like the Ace Amin's and Kid Chaos. And I, I, I love these guys. I love mm-hmm. Ace Amin. Uh, I love Ace Amin, Kid Chaos, J Lopez out of Milwaukee, Drix out of uh, Sacramento, Dev the Demon out of Oakland. Uh, uh, who mm-hmm. else got a night? Who else knew with a fire pin? That might be the, the the top five for me out of the new guys. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I know Ru Bando, mm-hmm. he's growing. He's growing. He's getting up there. He, I like, you know what I'm saying, in terms of just learning shit and getting better. Jay Kruger getting getting nice. Uh, you know what I'm saying? There's a few of them. A few, yeah, but I, I, I like those guys more than the newer guys. I mean, the older vets. Mm. Oh, yeah, you had another battle this year that a lot of people don't talk about. You versus HAW. You had that one. You went crazy in that one, too. They, they slept on me and HAW shit, man. Like I said, I've been working every week, man. So when a nigga got time to just really look back at my year, don't be like, oh, then he fucked up champion of the year. Nigga, I'm damn near still could win it. But Geechee has been going so crazy. It's it's mm-hmm. it's hard to really not see Geechee getting it, man. I'm not even being biased. Because you could say, yeah, well, he lost to... They're going to tell you he lost to Arsenal. He lost to Surf. They're going to say he lost to, uh, who else, Tay Rock. They're going to say he lost to John John. They're going to tell you he lost to this guy and that guy, right? Mm-hmm. Just tell me, just tell me, when have you seen a man take head ice, big K, Chess, and John John, and Arsenal, and Surf, and Rock, and Ill Will, and Big um, and Big T in like ten and months. And the two on two, and the two on two, and the two on two. Two on two, two on two, and taking guys like uh Ted down there in uh West Memphis, Arkansas, taking K philosophy, taking Don Marino in between, and hosting and doing videos. And he's champion of the year, man. It it, it ain't about the wins and losses because the wins and losses that don't it ain't uh, who's winning the most. Who's he's, 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 he's He's firing all these battles. He ain't choking. He's he ain't stumbling. He's rebuttaling niggas every battle, shaking the room. He he's making them great. But he's making great battles. And and he just had Big T last night. Got Big T out of there. And now he's about to go in there and go to war with O Red in in five and six honestly, days. Honestly, this is really only his. This is really only Geechee Gotti's second year on the big stage. Like. You know Second I mean? year, like, bro. Like, I don't, I don't count everything that happened like back in the days. I count from last year and this year. That's all I count. Really? You've never, you've never seen nothing like this in battle history. I yeah. haven't even had Surf and Arsenal and Rock. He had all these niggas in the same year. <laughs> and Arsenal. <laughs> I never had none of these niggas in my career. Not one time. I never had no Surf or Arsenal or Ill Will. This nigga had all these niggas in nine months. This is champion of the year shit, man. Let's not let's not, like stop stop trying to say he lost this one lost. Nigga, look what he's done. And who else could have fought all them niggas and lived and faced that type of pressure and not choked? Who else could have did John, that? And then Big K and then here. And, 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 and we're talking about and we're talking about we're talking about seven days in between. He's doing this seven days. He's battling one nigga on Saturday. Then the next Saturday, he's flying out and battling the next nigga. And he got three crazy original rounds for all of them with no choice. No how is no how is he not the champion? How is he no not back there? Like, no, dog, put it like this. No recycles. If if he can do all that and still not get champion of the year, I don't know what you got to do to get champion of the year, dog. And I'm I'm really boxing hard for the homie. And, yeah, you can sound biased. But this, but this is also facts, though. See what I'm saying? Like nothing I'm saying is made up. Y'all could go research everything I just said. You can, you can look at it and see what I'm saying is tangible. This ain't no Danny just trying to cap for his homeboy. Nah, nigga, this is a fact. I would have, I felt like I could have got it had I not choked versus Stewie and Pass. Like I felt like I could have got it. Like me doing this with Hollow and Big T and all the shit I've been doing too. Like I've been going crazy too. It's not, I ain't mm-hmm. trying to discredit my stuff. I've been going crazy too, nigga. Well, yeah, you know, I just respect and respect and salute to the process, and I hope it works out. You know what I'm saying? The best for the best person. But like you said, you, you guys have to do anything. You've been doing yours too, and I mean, you really can't take away from nobody because y'all really have had some solid looks. And I think for you, I think the next step needs to be the bigger names, all of the aforementioned people that you have not got. 
but should be starting to get. Like, you should be seeing these legends and these big names. Like, I always felt like you should have been there. But Should have been had them. They've been running, though. See, that's the thing. It wasn't like nobody wasn't trying to book it. It was – they was at, they was calling both of us, and they was just like, nah, no. Or it just didn't – the situation just didn't happen. But it's cool. Like, I just kept moving forward. I don't cry, complain. I don't be – I just keep going. You know what I'm saying? So that's why you will see me go and take an Amzilla or, or, or an up-and-comer because these niggas ain't scared because it's like – it's a win-win for them. They don't have to beat me. They just got to show out and show up. And as long as I can do that for them, like many people might not have heard of a bankhead before they seen me in bankhead. Mm, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah, you clearly beat them, but that's good to see. Yeah, I beat them, but it's like, like let me help put the newer guys on. And you don't see these other uh, so-called cop here, elite niggas putting these niggas on. See, the thing is, they'll clown me, say, oh, Danny, you just took backyard Bob and – no, actually, these niggas is nice, man. And I remember being in a position where all you needed was just a look, but nobody would give it to you. So I'm like, I'm, I'm mm-hmm. actually just coming back and reaching out and help pulling brothers up. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Like, look, bro, just go crazy, bro. I don't care if you win or don't. Just go crazy. You know what I'm saying? And and you're going to be on from there. And they got on. Nigga, I, I battled Bankhead. He got on URL right after that. I battled Mac Myrie. He he got on URL right after that. I battled. Hey, hey, hey! Check this out. I battled Young NASA out of West Memphis, Arkansas. Nobody ever heard of him. He got it. He just had his URL PG on on Saturday. Right after me, I'm helping. I'm helping put newer faces in the game and helping them get them looks. Man, like this is what I could do for them. Like, why not do it? I'm coming to the end of my career, so why not help somebody else? Why before I make my grand exit? Pass the torch down to these niggas, man. Like, like, and they not scared to get in there. But if I call a, a big name nigga out, it's it's all the politics. Oh no, I need this some X amount of dollars for you. Oh, you're trash, Danny. I don't want to battle you. Who are you? They try to play that shit, but it's like, come on, dog. You niggas still trying to play that shit. Come on, my nigga. Look at my resume, nigga. Don't yeah, don't try to is. play. Look at my resume for real. Like for real, mm-hmm. my nigga. The nigga said, do you believe in a parallel universe? Nah, fuck that. You're not getting one. If there is a parallel universe. If there is a parallel universe, you couldn't fit in one. <laughs> yeah, Big T, Big T didn't even get the parallel. Nah, nah y'all went crazy yeah. on it right, right quick. It was it was just some light. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, they just hit us, got a couple weeks to put some shit together. You know what I'm saying? And actually, they finna be doing more of those. They finna be doing those off and like every every six weeks they finna like do one of them. Oh little app like, updates. Secret was battle, your yeah. Every... Was your was your was your round short versus hollow? Nah. Nah, he got nah he nah see 'cause I knew I knew he wasn't finna do no two thirty. So I was like, nah, we finna do four rounds. So I gave him four rounds. <laughs> He's like, no, he wasn't let him get off. He wasn't letting him get off like that. Yeah, yeah. We had about the same amount of time. We rapped like the same amount of time. Like it was it was pretty eagle. Because, you know, I battle niggas, and they be trying to, like, hit, get me with 10-minute rounds. <laughs> the, <laughs> time limit, the time limit be 2.30, and they got they got eight minutes. Like, check check me and Chess. Check me and Chess, and check me and uh, Amzilla. You know what oh, I'm yeah, saying? Oh, Chess this year, too. Damn, dog. Yeah. Yeah. Dog. yeah, check. Yeah. yeah, beat him. Got him out of there. Got him emotional. Yeah, beat, beat the kid. Yo, I beat man. the kid. Be to you know what I'm saying? They be trying to play your head. They be trying to play hey. the year, my nigga. They, they try to play, play me, man. Like that. That's you why I said. That's why. Right. You the you the rock villain. You the shit on the Philly car. Yeah, they just hit me. Yeah, man. Stairs, matter of fact, yeah, they just hit me too for some shit in March. So mm. yeah, man. Uh, yeah, man. Well, like we gonna, I, we gonna we gonna. Um, I want you to just give you know give you a shout outs. We're gonna cut this short because I wanna hit you back and ask you about some things that I'm not gonna talk about on the line. But you know, we about forty minutes now. I think, you know, the public school education, we don't wanna lose nobody. So let's just Right, right, right. Mm-hmm. Uh give you shout outs, you know what I'm saying, and we can get out. Yo, man, shout out to shout out to you, man. Shout out to all the fans out there, man. Uh y'all rock with me. Uh y'all rock with Vita Man. Uh support it, Rice mm-hmm. Gang shit. Uh shout out to Showtime S P what's up, my nigga. Uh, mm. fuck with me, man. Fuck with my YouTube channel too. Subscribe to my channel. You know I got a lot yeah. more content coming. I got I'm, I got writing tutorials that I'm that I'm dropping on my channel. So I'll help y'all get y'all pen game up. So if you need tips yeah. and pointers, 
if you need, yeah, and this is like y'all getting authentic writing insider expertise from the bar guy himself. So subscribe to my channel. I got interviews, all kind of shit, man. So yeah, yeah man, that, that's it. Up there. I watch your interviews. I subscribe. I watch your case. I watch your suit surf. I watch you know what I'm saying the big T joints. Yeah, you got some definitely dope content. I'm gonna pin your channel to the top of this comment so people can see it and subscribe to it. And I'm yeah, man. Uh, yeah. Also, real quick, battlerapstats dot com slash shop. Get your uh, don't panic uh, hoodies. Get your parallel universe t shirts and hats. Support me, man. And I, hey, 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 one man, I'm I'm out here, man. I'm the goat, man. I told these niggas. <laughs> I told right, them. Man, good. You, you could go back inside now, and I hope that we don't see you again on the stage till 2020. You could take a break. You succeeded. Hey, in the real shit, yeah. real shit. They wanted me next week on volume five. Like hey, I was supposed to be on. Me and Suge was supposed to battle next week. Like, I was like, nah, told, man, let me focus. Let, let, I told him, no, let me focus for hollow. Then I'll get shook next year. So, you know. Yeah, I, you know, hey. we don't let you end like that, man. We ain't going to bring you back. Because then if you was to choke against him, they'll take your hollow away. So we're right, exactly. We gonna... Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> no way. But it's good talking to you, bro. I'm going to hit you right back. All right. <laughs>